Hello and welcome back to Nonsense Farm. It is raining outside this weekend, so I can't do anything out on the farm. So today I am restocking our world famous lip balm. This seriously is the best lip balm in the world. After I started making this, I could not use any other kind of lip balm. I have to use this. And when you think about it, it makes sense to use a lip balm that has all edible ingredients in it because you're putting it around your actual mouth. So if you're trying to reduce the toxin load on your body, it's important to consider that. Look at the ingredients of the lip balm you're currently using and then go to nonsensefarm.com slash shop and order some of our lip balm because you need some of this. Trust me on that. Also, the two best ways you can support what we do here on Nonsense Farm. Number one, go to the shop, buy some soap, buy some lip balm, buy some honey whatever we have in the shop. Also, hit that subscribe button. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. It really, really helps. All right, so here are the ingredients we need for this lip balm. Unlike when we're making soap, there's absolutely no dangerous ingredients or chemical reactions or anything when you make lip balm. So it's a much lower key process. All right, first I need virgin coconut oil. I'm weighing all this out on a digital scale because it's important to be accurate. Next is sweet almond oil. Next, we need castor oil, small amount, 32 grams of lemon. Beeswax, 106 grams of All right, there's also vitamin E oil and also rosemary oleoresin extract. But we add those after we bring the milk to the other oils. With everything measured out, now we're going to put it over kind of a double boiler kind of situation and let everything melt together. Now that it's all melted, we're going to add vitamin E oil, rosemary antioxidant oil, which is just something to keep the uh, various oils from oxidizing in the product, but it's again just an extract from rosemary. Now we're going to put in just a little bit of peppermint essential oil. This takes a while. Now we are going to pour it into the tubes. cooled off and the lip balm is good and hard. So now I'm going to put lids on them all. And now we'll put on the labels.
And there we go. We are restocked on Lip Balm.